Josue Vargas got back in the ring. And <clears throat> there's a lot of storylines in this fight. So he gets knocked down in, I think, the third round. But that knockdown, I really didn't think it was an actual knockdown. But there was a punch that was thrown and it did hit Vargas's uh, shoulder. But Vargas was sort of off balance. All right. Whatever. But then um, DeMario ended up catching him, cl- catching Vargas clean with a, uh, and, you know, a real knockdown. <clears throat> and actually, there was three times when Vargas went down. There was a second time that Vargas went down that I actually thought was an actual knockdown. But the referee scored it as a slip. And it looked more of a knockdown than the first actual knockdown, but whatever. And then DeMario actually caught Vargas with a an actual, you know, true knockdown. And it was flush. And Vargas was down, you know. So at this point of the fight... Vargas is losing bad to me. I'm my, I mean, my opinion. But then this dude, DeMario, he comes through and bites Josue Vargas. Like, he bit him in the arm. Like, Tyson style, but like, yeah, he actually, yeah, yeah, he bit him. I know it's crazy. I know it's crazy, but he, he bit him, right? So he bites him in the arm. The referee takes a point off in the same round that he got the knockdown, that he scored the knockdown. So it sort of negates the knockdown that he got. Yeah. Then it was just like Vargas just went back to boxing. Nothing, any, anything spectacular, but just, you know, he's a prospect. I mean, he's still... He he has good style and everything like that. Nothing crazy. It wasn't anything. And he still was getting caught with stuff. So Vargas is really not good like that. Like, I well, I don't want to say he's not good, right? But he's just, his chin has problems, has serious issues. And he and for a southpaw, he should be given a lot more problems to fighters than what he's doing. And this was his first fight back, so you would think that they would find find a fighter that would be that would be easy and but oh man, this this was oh. Anyway, um I don't know what to I don't want I don't know what to make of, of Vargas anymore, to be truthful. But I think that I think that Vargas has to figure out the mental piece. I think that his, it seems like his athleticism, you know, is there. It's just, he's just not, his, he's making mental lapses of judgment. So, whatever. Um, I, I was expecting him to, to get knocked out before that bite (laughs) but now you know after that guy went tyson on him then whatever that's that's how that stuff goes so yeah it was it was weird it was very very weird very strange and if y'all can't i mean i'm going to put up the picture of the bite i probably will put the picture i don't know if i want to do the picture of the bite or i want to do the picture of vargas getting knocked down see that's what i'm saying it it just messes up the whole storyline all right. Well, I'll make a decision, and uh, I probably would put both of them up. Like I'll put one up for one day, and the other up for another day. See what y'all like. But anyway, <laughs> it was weird. It was a weird. It was it was just a weird fight, and Vargas ended up winning. Oh yes, I didn't even tell y'all. So Vargas ended up winning. So and it was it was close, very close, close scorecards, but 
unanimous decision victory for Vargas. So, yeah. <laughs> on to the next. So, uh, we're, we're on Johnson versus Chavez. So, still in the top rank card. But we we will be moving over to the Showtime because you know the Showtime card is the card is the card card. You know what we're doing. Timothy Zoo and Terrell Gache. Hey, I've been seeing some good stuff about Gache lately that he's been in the lab cooking. So we're gonna see, man. It might be some it might be some gumbo going on. I don't think I don't know. If we're going to be going down under when it comes to this fight, I don't know. Hey, but to all the Australian fans, I, y'all been y'all been supporting your man. So, so uh, you know, big ups to y'all. And congratulations to uh, Ebony for go ahead and, and getting that, that victory and the new. So congratulations on that. And yeah. And with that being said, peace, one love. We out here. See you at the top.